back to my channel if you have not like and subscribe then please go to the google and search for the alien tech champion this channel is um, main for the tech setting technical news about microsoft endpoint manager or anything related to the mobile devices or any operating system uh, like windows android or uh, apple ios operating system or anything related to the mobile ticks today i am going to show you how you can get the crash logs from your android devices if you have a samsung devices like for other android devices you can also get it but there is some option may be different so i'm going to show you on your own on, on my samsung devices how you can get the crash logs so that for any troubleshooting purpose uh you, you will capture the informations uh, from from the android devices okay so as you can see my screen right so the first what you have to do you have to plug your android devices uh, i'm just for the sharing the screen or will you just have to go to the developer options since my developer option is disabled so that i cannot show you but uh, let me connect uh, on, on my devices through so that i can show you how from where you can enable the developer options so if you have a samsung devices you if you go to the settings okay and click on about phone right and click on the software information and then you'll see the build number tap seven times on the build number and if you have a passcode enable you have to enter the passcode and you will see the developer mode is enabled uh, developer uh, mode is actually will 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 actually enable by default and then you can i just allowed on my devices right so that you, i can broadcast my devices so that you can see so you see here my devices yeah so this is my devices i just enable the developer options so where you have to go just so just go to the settings right and if you go to the about phone you see here and click on the software information and this is the build number right you see here this is the build number if you just have to click for me it's in the developer mode is already enabled because i am broadcasting so you have to just tap seven times and the developer option will be enabled and you will see about phone there is a developer option is enabled it, it is turned on and then you i just enable the usb debugging so that i can broadcast messages just for uh, sharing my device screen so once your developer uh, option is enabled right for if you using any other samsung devices i mean other than the samsung devices you simply go to the settings app system and advanced expand the list and you will option the developer option enable the developer option from there so there is only difference i mean from on the samsung devices you just have to go to the settings and about phone on other non samsung devices you just have to go to setting and system apps and advanced and then developer options there is no much difference so i'm going to the developer option again here and and then once you enable the developer options right you will see the bug report can you see the bug report uh, you will see the bug report here and memory and the bug report you see once i click on this bug report you will see the interactive report and full report what is the difference between interactive report so interactive report is actually most uh, in most circumstances it allow you track progress of the report enter more detail about the problem and take a screenshot it might omit some less un list use section that take long time to report full report is a minimum system interface when your device is unresponsive or too slow so you want to of course you want to take the interactive report yeah just click on that interactive report right or maybe full report whatever you want right and click on report right once you click on the report you see here anything is happening no there are so many options are enabled right if you click on bug report 
interactive report let's see what, what is happening there nothing right there is no more options there so this is the way actually you can take the bug re report of interactive or full reports and enable the developer options right and then once this okay you see the screenshot taken with the bug report you got the message right so yeah, okay 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 so this is how you can enable the developer option it's very easy and you can capture the bug reports interactive or full whatever you want to do and once the interactive uh, report will be generated then you can take the bug reports and just save with you through the gmail or wherever you want to save i hope you can uh you you, you learn how you can uh, if you want to select the uh, selected app for the bug reports you see here I got this message bug one report has been captured this one on the top on the notification area if you click that bug report content click on don't say click on ok and then it will ask you to share uh, through my gmail me okay and this is the bug report you can share with to my gmail let me send it okay and i will show you on my gmail as well Okay, let me open the Gmail and show you the bug report. Or, I, in fact, I can open in my PC as well. Okay, just refreshing my mailbox. This is how you can generate the bug report, and you will get the bug report and send to your support team for any. Come on. It's uploading actually currently. So it will take few minutes. It's sending actually. So you see in the draft mode because I have no see. Okay. So once you download this crash report then then you can the and and then keep and then look for the error in the in the crash report or you can share with the developers i hope you learn how you can actually um, how you can actually share your bug reports to to any of them yeah i see it's it, it had been sent let me open just yeah you see here i just sent it and if i download this bug report and this screenshot i think you yeah, see here this is the screenshot and this is the zip file yeah you see here all these photos all the dump state you can open Dumpster txt version windows everything all the logs are there you can so this is the log bug report which i have got from pc and you see this is how you can get the crash report and the bug report from your android devices for any troubleshooting purpose so don't forget to like and subscribe the channel till then thank you have a good